The general consensus is that mermaids do not exist, and the myth that they do merely came into being because delirious sailors would look at manatees and, in their exhausted state, mistake them for seductive female sea creatures. But what if the logical answer is a big load of codswallop? What if the rational reasoning behind why we think mermaids exist was made up by the FBI to distract us from the truth that mermaids truly do exist? And what if they are far from the aerial stereotype we've come to know? What if they are far more terrifying and evil. These are the scariest sightings of mermaids. Before we begin, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos every day. That being said, let's begin. <sighs> Number 10. Mexico. This amazing footage surfaced in August 2016. It appears to show a mermaid, obviously that's the topic of the video, swimming through murky waters surrounding an underwater cave in Mexico. The diver who got the footage explained how the footage came about. He was swimming with a few friends of his near Cancun, Mexico. He was swimming in what is generally known as a sea note. For those of you who don't know what that means, a sea note is a natural sinkhole that opens up when bedrock limestone collapses. Essentially, it's a deep pit of water. These things are hot spots for tourists who flock to swim in the enormous ponds. Now then, in the footage, you can see the diver swimming around in the cave. He takes time to film all of his friends, all of them exploring together. But it's not the diving friends having fun that's worthy of your attention, it's what happens in the background that you should be interested in. In the distance, you can just about make out a humanish shape swimming through the waters. But it's not quite human enough for us to simply ignore it. It seems to have a long tail instead of legs with a fanned fin at the end. And the creature doesn't swim in the clumsy, unnatural natural way that humans do, the creature glides effortlessly through the water. Experts who have analyzed the footage are, as you might expect, rather stunned at what's been captured. In all their dissection, they can't quite figure out what's going on, insisting that no CGI had been used, nor did they think that the clip has been in any way edited. Lots of people are considering this video hard evidence that mermaids exist. What do you think? Is this the proof that mermaid fanatics have been looking for, or nothing but a hoax? Have they been hiding in deep water caves all these years just waiting to be discovered, or is it all a con? Now it's time for the rare topic. When out fishing just offshore Brazil, there is no way these guys could have expected to photograph this incredible image, but if their story can be trusted, that is exactly what went down. Three guys were out in the water and hadn't gotten a bite in quite a long time. They were getting frustrated, but then one of them heard something darting through the water toward them. He could tell from the speed of the sound there was no way he was going to catch it, so he instead focused on grabbing a photo of it, thinking it may be a shark. But when he looked back at the photo, this is what he saw. Terrifying, right? Comment down below with the hashtag rare topic and we might pin the best comment in relation to this image. And now to the next topic. Number 9. Iceland. From the Ico of Mex to the land of ice, this extraordinary footage was captured by scientific deep sea explorers just off the coast of Iceland. This team of researchers captured something truly startling on film. As they maneuver through the murky waters, something truly unexpected happens. BAM! Some kind of unknown creature presses a webbed hand onto the glass of the vessel. In that brief moment, it looks like the poor explorers are being attacked by a Doug Jones character. It has four pointy claws connected by some web tissue. You might cast it off as nothing but a weird fish, but if you pay close attention to the footage, you'll notice the mystery hand has an opposable thumb. This is a feature normally associated with land-dwelling primates. Fish don't exactly need to open door handles or play guitars. It seems likely this may be a mermaid or some kind of human fish monster. A split second later, you can just make out the head of the animal or mermaid. It has large black eyes and a small defined mouth. Unfortunately, the mysterious creature darts off into the darkness as quickly as it appeared. As far as we're concerned, this is either a mermaid or Abe Sapien from the Hellboy comics has escaped into the real world. Number 8. Israel. While that last clip was a more monstrous take on the concept of a mermaid, this next clip is more in line with what you might think when you hear the word mermaid. Although, having said that, if you want to be super accurate, the original idea of mermaids was more like something out of a horror film than Disney's The Little Mermaid. Perhaps the earliest account of mermaids is the Syrian tale of Adargatis. She is often said to be the very first mermaid who became so after an attempt at suicide. Adargatis was a beautiful goddess who fell in love with a human shepherd. However, she accidentally kills him with her 
her godly power. Riddled with grief, she attempts to kill herself by diving into the depths of the ocean. Generally, when gods enter the ocean, they become fish. But this tale accounts that Atergatis was too beautiful to suffer this same fate, and the transformation stopped halfway through. Instead, Atergatis was given the body of a fish and kept her beautiful hair and head. The creepiest account of mermaids is by far the Greek account of the sirens. Although initially depicted as devilish creatures with the legs of birds, eventually adaptations began to describe them as beautiful women with the bodies of fish. These mythical sea creatures were native to a group of islands known as the Cyrenus, and they were just as deadly as they were beautiful. The sirens have the voice of goddesses and sang a beautiful song that could be heard from miles away. Sailors heard their song as they passed through on their ships, which put them into a a trance and lured them to the islands. The sirens seduced the men with their beauty and lulled them with their gorgeous song, just before slaying them and devouring their bodies with their razor-sharp teeth. The sirens were repeatedly present in Greek mythology, even appearing as one of Odysseus's obstacles during his home stretch. To further the idea that mermaids are violent creatures, the Russian tales of the Rosalki describe the half-fish, half-woman creatures as the lost souls of women who drown themselves in the ocean due to unwanted pregnancies. The Rusalki angrily stalks the ocean, hunting down men and children to take them as prey, torturing them and devouring them as payment for their death. While the ghastly tales of mermaids might be enough to keep you up at night. Many accounts of mermen may have you replanning your vacation to the ocean side. Many accounts of mermen, like in the original Little Mermaid tale, depict them as zombie fish of sorts. But what we have here is footage of a mermaid more in line with Mr. Disney's vision. This is some wild footage taken in Israel in 2005. It claims to show a real mermaid sunbathing on a rock in the ocean. Two tourists began filming on their phones when they noticed a strange figure down on one of the rocks. They filmed for several minutes, calling out to attract the attention of whatever's lying on the rocks. The creature becomes startled and dives backwards into the water. As it does so, it seems to reveal a long tail and finned feet. Incredible, right? It may as well have just been Ariel herself. And what's crazy about this is that that is far from the only mermaid sighting in the area. They seem to be surprisingly common. In fact, mermaid sightings have become so common in Israel that a mayor of a coastal town has even put up a bounty for anyone that has irrefutable proof. Kiryat Yam in the Haifa Bay District of Israel has a US $1 million reward for anyone that can show proof that mermaids exist. Sadly, this video wasn't deemed proof enough. Dozens of locals claim that they have had encounters. One man even says that a mermaid touched his leg while swimming in the bay. Blimey. He was so enamored by the encounter that he hopes he'll find the mermaid once more, claiming the brief rendezvous was like heaven. Either he was touched by a mermaid and he has met the love of his life, or his leg brushed up against some coral and he was more into it than he'd like to admit. Could this footage be proof of the Israel mermaid? What do you think? Number 7. Deep Sea. Our next clip comes from the deep sea, so deep in fact that we don't really know the exact region from which it was filmed, which is frustrating because it's kind of ruined the naming pattern we had going on for each of the segments in this video, but oh well. This footage was allegedly taken in 2006 by an NOAA deep sea research vessel. Of all the things they expected to find, we should imagine mermaids was pretty low on the list. The camera was lowered deep into the ocean to investigate and repair an oil tank used by the research team. As the camera scans the drum for damage, very types of fish float nearby, but something curious happened towards the tail end, get it, of the footage. Right at the very end, a strange and long-finned creature swiftly darts past the camera. It appears for all of a millisecond, making it hard to know for sure, but something is definitely there. And whatever it is, it doesn't look like any fish I've ever seen. And trust me, I know a lot about fish. I'm underwater right now. Go on, prove I'm lying. You can't. Some claim that the camera has caught a mermaid swimming by at incredible speeds, possibly curious about the intruding vessel. Others think it's nothing more than a deep sea eel or large fish. Unfortunately, the clip is far too blurry and too short to come to a definitive answer, but still, it's a serious possibility. What do you think? Mermaid or something else? Number 6. North Atlantic 
Sometimes, like in our last clip, remarkable discoveries are made by science teams, like you would expect. But other times, like in this next clip, the discoveries are made by more everyday folk. In this remarkable bit of footage from the very rough waters in the North Atlantic, you'll see what happened when some fishermen stumbled upon a possible mermaid. The incredible incident was caught by a shaky handycam. In this wobbly footage, we see the moment a strange sea creature, quite probably a mermaid, was brought up in the trawler's fishing nets. The men frantically fall about the deck of the boat as rough waters batter the ship from all sides. It's like something from The Perfect Storm or The Day After Tomorrow or any of those other environmentally themed action films that were all in the range of the early aughts. The mood is clearly tense as they realize they've caught something unusual in their nets. This is no fish they caught. They've caught something else. They've caught a possible future bride. As the camera operator gets closer, it becomes evident that something very large is clearly thrashing about in the net. Even a webbed hand can be seen reaching out mere moments before the catch falls back into the water. What do you think this footage has captured? Is it a mermaid or some other wild sea creature that is yet to be classified? Or is it all an elaborate hoax? And if it is, were the fishermen in on it or were they just as confused as we are? Number 5. The Mermaid of Kiriat Yam a mermaid excitement swept across Kiryat Yam, a town in Israel, in 2009 when a mermaid appeared at dusk to entertain both tourists and locals. Residents claimed to see a creature whose form was part fish and part woman of young age. The mermaid that was sunbathing, according to the first person who saw it, jumped from the sand and vanished through the waves as he and his colleagues approached it. The team was astonished to realize that the sunbathing woman had a tail instead of legs. This singular sighting was not secluded, since when people got wind of the story, many claimed that they had sighted the Kiryat Yam Mermaid. Many years after the sighting, the Kiryat Yam Mermaid has gained tremendous popularity, so much so that the town council has promised a $1 million prize to anyone with sufficient evidence to prove the existence of the mermaid. To date, no one has won the money since only limited sightings have been reported. Number 4 Zimbabwe Mermaids A construction team in Zimbabwe was going about their work on the Osborne and Gakwe dams in 2012. Suddenly, all of them were scampering for safety after being terrified by a furious mermaid. The mermaid, referred by the local residents as the Mamba Muntu, often tormented workers as they executed their construction tasks. The local workers, who grew up amidst myth and tradition, had a strong belief that the emergence of the Mamba Muntu mermaid was a bad sign, and eventually halted the construction work. In a bid to complete construction of the dams, the local council employed foreign workers. They figured that by employing workers who were unfamiliar with the sightings of the Mamba Muntu mermaid, the work would be completed. The workers would later abandoned the project due to what they called harassment and rage of the Mamba Muntu mermaid. In a bid to calm down the seemingly angry mermaids, chieftains and members of the local council made a decision to execute ritual cleansing rites to make way for the completion of the dams. Number 3 Columbus and Caribbean Mermaids Christopher Columbus is popularly known for encountering mermaids during many of his expeditions in Hispaniola. Columbus would later write in his ship's ledger that together with his crew, they bumped into three mermaids across the waters in the Hispaniola island. Columbus went on to write that the mermaids were dancing in the water, and as the ship approached, the three creatures ascended out of the water. However, Columbus claims that the mermaids were not as attractive as he had imagined from reading history stories. Columbus opined that the mermaids he saw bore manly characteristics. Currently, historians think that Columbus and his team were indeed sighting a group of manatees, a huge, entirely aquatic, predominantly herbivorous mammal often referred to as sea cows. The lingering questions that many historians are yet to answer is whether an experienced captain of Columbus's stature would intentionally mistake the enormous sea cow for a woman regardless of her appearance. Number 2. The Orang Akan the fact that World War II was still ongoing in 1943 did not deter the sighting of one of the most well-documented and popular mermaids. Japanese soldier along the Indonesian K Islands had mounted an observation team. During their stay, various members of the observation team reported sighting a small figure with human characteristics in the water. Its mouth looked like a carp and it had spines around its neck. The mermaid creature was usually spotted playing along the shores of the beach and in lagoons 
across the Kay Islands. The Japanese soldiers were astonished by what they saw and discussed their sightings with the native residents. They would later establish that what they were looking at was a popular entity referred to as the human fish or orangutan. The sightings didn't stop, and the locals invited the group sergeant, Mr. Taro Hariba, to witness the creature their fishing nets had caught. When he arrived in the village, he proceeded to the chieftain's residence and found that one of the creatures had been sprayed on the floor. According to Mr. Taro, the creature's small body had red-brown hair, a lipless, humanoid face, spines on its neck, and a mouth similar to a fish, complete with sharp teeth. Mr. Hariba was not only shocked, but he was confused by the creature. He later encouraged zoologists to scrutinize the creature once the war was over. People hardly believed his mermaid stories in the islands of Kay, and many are yet to understand whether what he saw were actual mermaids or a case of misidentification. Number 1. The Kaiman a renowned mermaid named Kaiman made waves in the South African news in 2008. A team of friends had gone camping close to a river when suddenly loud banging and splashing sounds hit the air. Upon investigating, the team discovered a woman whose hair was black and long. She seemed to be pale white and her skin had a luster that gave her an astonishing glow. However, one feature shocked the team when the woman turned. Her eyes were piercing red. When claims of the sighting of the Kaiman went around, a woman from the team hastened to investigate them. She later reported that the mermaid cried sorrowfully, a sound which was similar to that of a crying woman. After a chaotic moment within the group, the creature vanished in the dirty water. South African natives are cautious of the Kaiman mermaid. Stories of how she pulls people and snarls them with the things they love abound. Is the Kaiman a mythical mermaid or an agitated swimmer? South African natives are still trying to figure out whether what they saw was flesh or just a myth.